What's up everyone? Welcome to another ball review. Uh, today we're going to go over the Roto Group Idol Cosmos and I'm going to feature six other bowling balls but for, for today's video uh, as I'm throwing shots I'm going to rotate through each ball and I'm also going to commentate while I'm throwing each ball so you can get an idea of what I'm thinking uh, after I throw each ball. Let me know down in the comments if you like this style of ball review or you prefer the ball reviews I've styles that I've been doing in the past. All right, without any further ado, I'm going to get on the lane, throw some balls, and let you know what I think about these, the newest release, the Idol Cosmos. Uh, today we'll be reviewing the newest Rotor Grip ball, the, the Idol Cosmos. And I'll be comparing that ball to the Idol Helios, a 900 Global Zen, and a Wolverine, the Storm High Road, and a UC2. Even though the UC2 is an asymmetrical ball, it is a little bit weaker for me, so I wanted to show you guys what it looks like. All right, what surfaces do I have on all these balls? Well, the Idol Cosmos is out of box. I haven't touched it yet, so we're gonna see how it does today on the south shot. The Helios I hit with 3,000 on a ball spinner. That way it gets it closer to that 4,000 uh, that's out of the box for the Cosmos. The Zen is basically out of box. I haven't touched it. The Wolverine is at 2,000 on a ball spinner. My High Road is at 3,000 on a ball spinner. And the UC2 has, still has the polish and has some lane shine on it. I've hit, hit, I've hit it over time. With just to scuff it up a little bit, but it's basically shiny as well. All right, guys, the first ball up is going to be the 900 Global Zen. Uh, this is the second Zen I've drilled up. Uh, this one is four by four by two BLS layout. Uh, it's uh, showcased it in my last ball video from with the Zen Soul. So let's see here, see how it goes. Pretty good shot. There you go, that's a nice shot right there. Clean through the heads. Because of the four inch pin and this, this is a stronger symmetrical ball, it does want to pick up earlier. Uh, and nice smooth off the dry. A little continuous. Okay, next up is gonna be Idle Helios. So we're gonna stay in the same spot. And now that's good. Um, I'm not sure what the Helios is drill. I gotta find that out for you guys. That wasn't a very good shot. This, this solid cover for me, uh, with the Nano in it, it's a little slow a little clean through the front, so I haven't really figured out a way to match up with it. Um, you saw it in my video where I compared it to a phase two. That was with the surface at 1,000 grit, where today it's at 3,000. Let's go a little straighter line here, let's see. Yeah, see, that's really clean. Gets down the mid lane, it's not sure what it wants to do. So this ball, to me, I'm just not, not that I'm not a fan of the idle. Just doesn't match it up with me. All right, now let's throw the Cosmos ball that we're showcasing in this video. Uh, this one, this ball is drilled five by four by two and three quarters VLS layout. Uh, it's gonna stay in the same place again and see how this ball rolls. That's a pretty good shot right there. Now you see it's Gets down the lane just as clean as the idle Helios for me. Uh, picks up in the mid lane better, so there's a little bit more push, I think, than on the Helios, where it's just a solid cover with Nano. Uh, so, all right. That was a pretty, pretty good shot. Continuous to the pocket. Um, that This, by far, is like the best reaction I had at any of the idols. I didn't throw the original idol. Uh, I did have an idol Pearl when those came out. That was a while ago. All right, let's throw this high road. Get that one out of the dry. That one's cleaner. Do it out, I want. Do that one out to the right. Uh, it's cleaner. A little more forward. I don't know. This is another one. I wanted to try a high road and see how it fit in my game. I haven't really figured out what the, how this one works, where it fits in the arsenal. So one more shot with it. A little better one. 
me a little straight a little straighter. Yeah, see it's clean, it revs up in the mid lane, and it's just not enough for the front of house shot. Maybe on a spore pattern, that would be a lot better for me. Uh, I just haven't figured out what spore pattern to really use it on. Alright, next up is going to be the 900 Global Wolverine with 2000. This ball has been very forward for me. And then with the polish on it, it was very under over on the house shots. Even on sport patterns, I'm not sure where I throw it yet. I haven't really used it much out in the PBA 50 Tour. That's another one. See, it's really clean, confused in the mid lane. Not sure if it wants to hook or not. Down lane, so let's, I'm gonna move right with that ball, throw another one. See, if you get it to the spot, it comes off the spot pretty good. It's just really clean, really confused on what it wants to do on this house shot. And I'm not sure who was here before me or what guy I, I know I, if i throw on the right lane uh, there was a lot of carry down with open bowlers that were here earlier before me all right and then the last up is the uc2 that's nice you can tell it's a little bit stronger ball cuts through the oil better Four inch pin. Uh, that one's four by four and a half by two and a half VLS layout. So that one was proof. All right, there are some of my first initial shots with the six bowling balls. Uh, down in the comments, let me know what you think about all six of these bowling balls, how they compare to each other, and how they fit in my game, and maybe where I should use them. All right, quick run through. We're going to show you what the bolt, the layouts look like on the bowling balls. All right, that's the UC2. Four by four and a half by two and a half. That's my high road. Not sure what the VLS layout is. It's a four and a half inch pin. Uh, and then there's the Cosmos. Okay. And then we got the Wolverine, the Helios, and also the Zen that I featured in my Zen Soul video. Four by four by two VLS layout. All right. With the next set of shots, I'm gonna I'm gonna make a big move left and. Uh, See if I can go left to right and see how these balls shape on the pattern today. So we're going to go back to the rotation. Zen is going to be first. I'm going to move, make a big move left. Whoops. Bad shot. That's not a very good shot, but that's all right. Ball shape really good. Let's try Let's throw one more. Let's make a better shot than that. There we go. That's a better shot. There you go, nice shot, all right. All right, now let's throw the Helios. Still really clean. This ball really needs some friction for me. It just doesn't want to come off the dry at the end of the pattern, just too, gets down lane too fast for me. That's why I'm really confused by it. I'm not sure where to use it. Uh, I'd rather, to me, I would rather use a phase two um, or the, the Zen Soul, because uh, those, those balls seem to roll a lot better for me in my game. So, okay, let's throw the Cosmos. Oh, that's a good shot right there. You can see, even that was a really good shot. Uh, that ball gets down the lane nice and clean, but it really wants to pick up in the mid lane compared to the Helios. So maybe because of that, the Nano that's in that cover, it just, for my eyes, it doesn't give me the type of reaction I'm looking for. I'm going to throw that ball again because we're featuring it in this look. All right, one more shot with the Cosmos. That's a little farther right. Yeah, see, I got that one too far right, and it just burned up. So that the 4,000 on it, uh, I'm just going to have to adjust the surface a little bit to give me a little more teeth. Same thing what I'm going to do with the Infinite Physics. Uh, they give it a little more teeth to get through you know, the oils, you know, with this house shot, that little higher volume, uh, it does that for me. All right, let's throw the high road. 
Like surfaces on these bowling balls are really key for me. Uh, the solids, I like to keep at a thousand. The pearls, two thousand ish, maybe. And then the other ones, we'll just see as we as they get to where they're doing 4K and 4K fast. We'll have to see how those roll for me now without the polish. Oh, that's in left. That was left, but ball got down lane pretty clean. Picked up in the mid lane. Not bad. I mean, it's really clean, really quick. Uh, this is another ball. I kind of need some friction down lane with. All right, let's try the Wolverine, which for me has been kind of stronger than the high road on house shots, but it still really likes to be forward. That's a pretty good shot right there. So yeah, that was nice. So you saw it, it was clean down the lane. It kind of pushed a little bit. Uh, then it started picking up on the dry and can, and finish where the shot before it, it was just so forward that it stopped. It was just too dry to the right. All right, and the last ball we're gonna throw is the UC2. By and far, one of my, one of the pearls that I, I like. I like the stronger cover, core with this weaker pearl cover. Let's see how this one goes. That's a pretty good shot right there. And see, that's a little cleaner than the Wolverine. Uh, and then, but same kind of motion down lane. All right, we're gonna finish up throwing. Now that we went through both bowling ball, all the six bowling balls, uh, we're gonna throw. I'm just gonna showcase some shots with the Helios. We're gonna move all around the lane. Uh, play a little straighter. Play a little deeper. Just to show you guys what it looks like. All right, we're gonna go do a little more straighter down and in shot. Let's see how this works. That was really good. Yeah, take that nine pin. All right, let's move over a little bit again. So let me know in the comments what you guys think. How do you how do you like this ball on my hand at the surface that it's at? Uh, what what I think I could use it on because I haven't used it in tournament play yet. I'm right, gonna move back again to where I started originally. That's a pretty good shot right there. Eh, not bad. A little clean, a little wiggly down lane when I moved into a little bit more oil. And then off the dry, it just wasn't. Kind of puked a little bit. So, all right, and let's, let me move again, move a little deeper. Slow it down a little bit, slow loop it for my low rev rate. See, that's not good at all. Too much oil for that ball in there. We really need some friction down lane. All right, guys, thank you very much for watching. That's my ball review on the new Roto Grip Idol Cosmos. Uh, if you have any questions about any layouts or anything I'm doing uh, on these bowling balls, just put them down in the comments. Make sure you take time to like, subscribe, and hit that bell for notifications on more content.